Hey guys, Andrew from Autoflight here and welcome back for another video. Got a really cool product to take you through today. It's a new release from Axial and an addition to the SCX6 line of vehicles that Axial have produced and it's the Trail Honcho. So many of you would probably be familiar with the Trail Honcho in the 10 scale platform. So the SCX10 II, the Trail Honcho has been a really solid performer across the SEX 10.2 range and Axial's crawler range for a number of years now. It's undergone some revisions in the 10 scale side and Axial have decided to bring it to the SEX 6 line of vehicles, um, which is fantastic. It offers us a different body styling to the, the original SEX 6 Jeep. Um, they've added a lot of detail to this. Just looking at the body itself, um, a lot of effort has been put in to make this look as realistic as possible. So Axial have added LED lights in the bumper, in the body shell, spare tire fully functional and uh, wheel tracks as well um, with a wheel track like mount uh, so you can stick them at the back and they're located and secured in so they won't fall out but then you can take them out um, the tray the cockpit the steering wheel um, there's a lot of detail that's gone into this shell from the chassis side of things it is the SCX6 chassis so uh, very similar component tree to the original SCX6 full spectrum brushless system got a two-speed gearbox in it, two-speed changing servo, so you can adjust that on the fly um, from the transmitter. You have a nice big metal gear servo for the steering, which is super powerful. Um, spectrum transmitter, obviously, spectrum receiver. The transmitter itself is really neat. It has throttle limiting functions. I know it's pretty ironic for a crawler, but when you're in high speed mode or, or high gear, um, you actually can use that if you're passing it along to someone uh, who's inexperienced. Obviously, you have the low gear option and the gear changing's done right off the transmitter, so super simple. You also have smart telemetry on this radio. So if you are using a smart battery with this car, um, the car doesn't come with a battery or charger, so you will need to purchase those separately. But if you choose to go with the smart system, uh, you get a battery LED indicator level uh, on the transmitter as well. So some feedback from the vehicle telling you where your battery's at during a run, so you know when you're about to go flat and when you need to change that over. Um, one of the other neat features too is the licensed Falcon tires. Now these are about seven inches tall. So this car is absolutely massive and it is equipped with all the running gear to make sure that it not only performs at that size, but is durable at that size as well. So let's pop the shelf and take a look. With the body shelf flipped up, we can take a look at the high quality component tree that's included in the SCX6. So using a two spectrum servos, uh, one down the back, which is for the gear change function. So you've got two speeds, your low and high gear, uh, we have a spectrum motor which is gigantic it's almost the size of a coke can in diameter so the motors are very large it is a brushless system as well so not a, a brush system that you conventionally see in a lot of 10 scale crawlers it does have the brushless spectrum esc it's under this motor molding and there's you can see the the top of the steering servo as well so a very large sort of one fifth one six size servo for the steering metal geared obviously so super strong very hard torque so really reliable components used in this the ESC uses an IC5 connector. Um, so when you're getting your batteries, you wanna get one with an IC5 on it. So either the Spectrum Smart Packs, which would be a great option, or Prime RC, do some fantastic options there. It has battery trays on both sides. So you can actually have two batteries in the vehicle only running off the one, but having the vehicle equally balanced left to right. So your performance over rocks isn't on an angle at all. The vehicle is nice and flat and level. So that's a great option from Axial. Also means you have to carry it around with you when you are walking trails. You can have it bolted in the car. Swapping a battery over is as simple as unplugging the connector, plugging it across to the other side. Now you'll notice some wires running all over this truck front and rear. That is the LEDs. This vehicle includes uh, 20 LEDs actually across the front and rear mounted in the body and the chassis. So a ton of effort has gone into the scale realism of this vehicle. And as a consequence, lots of LEDs in the car. So super easy to uh, work with though. The body does hinge up and it's just a single plug that connects this baseline of LEDs to the body shell. Now, as far as the chassis itself, a lot of aluminium, so uh, coilover shocks, aluminium uh, bodies, adjustable collars, aluminium links, so everything's super durable, really beefy sliding drive shafts. So these move with the suspension as you uh, move the suspension up and down. Overall, a very solid build on the SCX6 platform. A lot of great additions for the, the trail honcho version. Thanks for joining us again today, guys, for another video. Hope you've enjoyed us taking you through the new Trail Honcha SCX6 from Axial. Very impressive car, uh, super durable, high performance, and really takes crawling to another level given the size of the vehicle. You can attack much larger obstacles than you could with a 10 scale crawler um, with a car that's got heaps of horsepower, a two speed gearbox, and an overall very high quality finish. So grab your battery, your charger, 
and you'd be ready to go with this vehicle. Now, it will be, it is available for pre-order now. So if you are interested, jump online, take a look, chuck a pre-order in, guarantee yourself one of these and uh, get ready to have a ton of fun. I'm Andrew from Autoflight and we'll catch you next time.